All right, I'm here at the Carmel community here in Pflugerville. I'm gonna preview a William Lyon home called the Nueces, but as you can see here, there's other home builders to choose from that have different floor plans and different elevations and lot sizes. But today I'm just gonna preview the Nueces uh, floor plan and see what you guys think. So let's go take a look. Hey there, real quickly before you see this home, I just wanna let you know that my purpose here is to help you find the perfect home and get the best deal possible. Now we can do that together by having what I call a home buyer's console and that's where we get together and I'll go through the entire process of what it takes to purchase a home, whether it's a brand new one like this one that you're about to see or a resale home and explain to you what the differences are. So that way you can be better prepared to make the best decision possible. You can get in contact with me directly at 512-809-0091. Now you can call or text me there or you can leave your name, number and email address directly below this video and I'll get in contact with you. All right, now back to the video. All right, so that's gonna be the stairs going up to the second uh, living area with some bedrooms. Let's go ahead and explore the downstairs here first. Over here to your left, it's gonna be a office, can probably be doubled as a uh, another bedroom if you'd like, but Makes a pretty good office. Over here to your left is going to be a half bath. And then it opens up into the kitchen and the living area. Right here is going to be a little hallway that goes to the utility room and the garage. Right back here. I'm not going to go in the garage because they're using it as a sales office right now. Let's take a look at this beautiful kitchen. So you're going to have this big main island as the centerpiece. You can probably fit four bar stools in it, but you're going to have a granite countertop with that chrome gooseneck faucet here. Now these is all staged with all the premium options available. They're gonna have different options and different elevations uh, that you can choose from. So the good thing about Carmel is that you're gonna have gas appliances for those that absolutely love cooking with gas. Um, your cooktop or ventilation microwave area. And then your walk-in pantry. And this is where your refrigerator is going to go. One thing to mention about this kitchen is that you're going to have a ton of cabinet space. From there to there. And then maybe even some in this island here. Let's take a look. Yeah. So then straight ahead be the dining area that also opens up into the living area here. Now let's take a look outside. It's going to be your back patio, covered little back patio. I'm sure you'll have different options for your back concrete slab, but pretty good size lot for a brand new home construction. Let's take a look at the rest of the inside. Now the master's gonna be off of this main dining area. Let's go take a look. Should be a little coat closet. This is going to be the master bedroom. 
Look at those windows letting in all that beautiful natural light. And let's go take a look at the master bed bathroom. Granite countertops, dual sinks, very important for him and her. And we have this low oversized tub here, perfect for soaking. And a walk-in shower. That's a pretty good size walk-in shower. I've seen them a lot smaller. Over here is going to be your room to do the uh, take care of your business and your toilet. And then your walk-in closet. Take a look at that. A lot of room. Then you have like a little shelf over here. All right. Master bedroom again. Walk out. Opens up to your living area, dining area, kitchen. Over here to the left. Let's go take a look upstairs and see how it looks. All right, coming up here, it's going to open up into a very large size second second living room i've got this beautifully staged with that l-shaped couch and big old tv nice little centerpiece there three big windows to let in a bunch of lights and you got some window over there uh above where the stairs go to let in a bunch of natural light in here just really brightens the place up and then you got three bedrooms up here and a full bath so let's take a look at that starting off with this one first bedroom you got a little walk-in closet over there let's take a look at that Very good size. This right here should be a little, little linen closet. Pretty good size there too. Fit a lot of towels and blankets and coats and stuff like that. Full bath right here. To the left here. Let's take a look at that. More space for towels. Granite countertop, dual vanities. Place to do your business here with the toilet. And then your tub and shower area right here. Now this bathroom is going to share, be shared by all the three bedrooms up here. So the size is important and very good. And going over here, it's your, going to be your third bedroom. This is a really nice size. Usually homes uh, that have four bedrooms. They're not as big. This one's a good size. And you got this nice little walk-in closet here. Then let's go take a look at the last bedroom. It's kind of reversed as the other one. Starting off with the walk-in closet. This one's a little bit bigger. Walk-in closet here. Fit some more stuff. And 
then the rest of the bedroom. All right, now that concludes this whole house. One other last thing I wanted to show. It's a little attic access there. You pull that little tab, you go in there, you can have some extra storage space.